So what are the chances, do you think, of being back? Uh, I think they're pretty high. Uh, you know, just take it day by day, uh, get better and better, just keep working, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to play. We'll see. Is this your first day at full pads? Uh, yeah, first day at full pads, uh, being able to come out here, run, uh, run around a little bit, uh, catch some balls, uh, felt great. So, yeah. So what exactly did they do to your ankle? Um, it was like a, a tight row surgery, uh, basically kind of like the same thing that uh, Tua Tiger, uh, the quarterback for Alabama, had. Yeah. Oh, they, so they did put in a metal piece and all that? Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. Wow. When did you start kind of moving freely again and running? Uh, I've been running since like last week or something like that. So, you know, it's been a great process. I've been able to get back out there and run full speed. It's, it's just been fun. I can't complain. How frustrating was the timing of that injury? Because you were just kind of getting your chance to be the, the lead guy and get a, a bulk of carries. Um, you know, of course it was uh, frustrating. Um, but I think everything happens for a reason. Um, like when I went down, uh, Keenan and Quincy got their chance, and they uh, did what they had to do. Um, and I'm proud for I'm proud of them. And with Vi and Steven being back, I'm proud of them how they played so far. Um, and I'm just you know excited for the whole room. Uh, everybody got their chance, and you know you just gotta you know take it on the chin and just know that uh, great things are ahead and just be patient. How important is it for you to play in this bowl game if you're able to and get one more chance to put a stamp on the season? Um, I think it would be very important. Uh, It'll help me uh, get, just get more experience. Uh, experience can't hurt. Um, and able to play uh, for Alabama. So, you know, I think, you know, with this experience, uh, it'd be great for me. What was your reaction to them bringing Coach Helton back? And I guess I had to wait a long time to find out. What was that like, man? Uh, that's something I can't discuss. Uh, I can't talk about that. So, you know, okay. Did you have any reaction to them coming back? Uh, I was happy. Uh, I was. I think he's, uh, Coach Allen has done a great job. Uh, you know, he's the guy that's uh, led us and continues to lead us, and I'm happy uh, that he's back. What percentage would you say the ankle is, or how do you feel? With it? Um, it feels great. Um, you know, I can't really discuss like, percentages and stuff like that, but it feels great. Are there some checkpoints they want you to hit uh, recovery-wise before yeah, that? Uh, doing a better. Uh, just continue to work on my cutting. Uh, get better at that. Um, hope that takes a big stride and be able to get back playing full speed. I know you mentioned Keenan, and but what did you think about just in specifics how he did? You know, in those games where I think he him. did. Keenan played uh, very, very well. Um, he stepped up when everybody went down, and that's you know that's something for for, for a freshman to do that. Uh, being down and him able to come back, that was great for us. What do you think about the future of you two? I mean, people are pretty excited with you, kind of the thunder and lightning with his speed. What do you think about that combo? Uh, I think it's going to be a great uh, one-two combo. Uh, I know we both got to continue to work and get better um, and just play as hard as we can in order for that to happen. So I think I'm like, but I think it's going to be great. How much would you love to be able to go against like a Big Ten defense like Iowa's kind of that mash, mash, mid meets your style of, you know, your physical running? Um, I would love it, uh, going and playing against Iowa. Uh, you know, it's big Midwest physical football game. That's, you know, that's what I play like. And I think that would be, I think it would be pretty fun playing against them. What jumps out when you're watching their defense on film? Uh, they're very big um, and strong, very physical. Uh, but I don't think that's anything we haven't seen. Uh, we played uh, Utah, we played Notre Dame, Washington. They're all physical teams. So I think it's definitely something that we haven't seen. And I think uh, you know it's going to be a great matchup, two different styles of football. Um, so maybe that's team win. Assuming you can come back, how do you think that would work? You know, this would be the first time we see all four of you guys healthy, all having played big minutes this season. How do you think that will work, just having all you guys ready at the same time? Um, honestly, I don't know. Um, <laughs> whoever plays, plays, and, you know, uh, the best guy plays. So you know, everybody's going to have a chance. It's just what you do with the opportunity, really. So. Yeah. I always got a pretty physical front line. Um, what have you seen in film that you like, you don't like? Um, I'm like, I haven't seen anything that I don't like because I think we can handle it. Um, with our guys up front, uh, when you have Austin Jackson and Lashford, Tucker, Drew Richmond, and guys like those, um, I think they uh, will hold it down. Uh, and I think that's something, like, I think they're going to do a great job. Do you know any of the guys on the Iowa team? Uh, yeah, there's a few kids uh, from my city that play on Iowa, so I know I know a few kids on the team that uh, they're, pretty, they're pretty good. Iowa's a pretty good football team, and we're a pretty good football team, so it's going to be a great game. I agree. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How did you not get down during that 
you know, the process of what uh, you were doing and then kind of having to stop, you know, obviously with the injury? Right. Uh, you know, uh, you finally feel like you get the chance uh, to be the lead guy and get injured. Um, of course, it's kind of, you know, frustrating and stuff. But you just got to remember to always be positive. Um, to always remember that great things are coming. And just remember uh, how you got to the point, uh, start from humble beginnings. And so just remain humble, uh, keep your head down, continue to work. And that's something that um, I continue to do and continue to pray and just hope, uh, hopefully, uh, wait for the better days. Was there anyone that you leaned on, maybe a teammate or a coach, or maybe someone back home? Uh, my family, uh, yeah, they, they showed a lot of support. Uh, when I had the surgery, my mom was out here for like two weeks or whatever, so uh, that really helped. Um, and all the coaches were uh, very supportive. Uh, just everybody, my family, friends, everybody. Thanks, Marky.